Good morning. I am Anuj Singhal. Today is the last day of the series, last day of uh, the month, and the last day of the year. Uh, unfortunately, it's not the last day of the week, uh, as we are still working on uh, on first tomorrow, which is ridiculous. Uh, but having said that, uh, let's talk about today. Well, oh, <laughs> what to say? I mean, you you've seen the kind of volumes that uh, that have been there for the last two or three days. Uh, uh, my my call went wrong yesterday. My my expectation was that the market would move up, uh, but it actually moved down in the second half. Uh, but these things happen. Uh, the sense you get is that uh, today the market should consolidate somewhere around 7900 and one sharp move maybe somewhere around 3, 3, 3 o'clock is not ruled out. So as of now, the range is 7850 to 7950 with 7900 as the base. Uh, but if you go by the data, the chance is that maybe, and uh, you know, the, the, it's a big risk, uh, maybe the market decides to have one more a shot at uh, 7950 to 8000 band in today's trade at some point in the second half of the day that could happen but if that does not happen uh, the, the sense you get is that in the month of january the market if it takes out 8000 and 8000 is big resistance has a chance of going to 8100 or 8200 and try to negate that lower top lower bottom formation that the market has made uh, which would be good news for the bulls but which would also be a big test for the market uh, but we'll take it as it uh, as things come for today, uh, clearly, the strategy would be to just stay on the sidelines, observe what the market is doing, uh, and maybe you know at around two o'clock or two thirty, when the option prices are almost nothing, if you want to take a punt, maybe you can do that. Uh, that's that's the only way to play the market today, uh, and individual stocks could be really volatile.